Hey guys, welcome back to another video. In this video, we're going to be talking about SafeMoon. I am on a new exchange, obviously, looking at this right now because that's where we get listed. So, big day ahead once again, another big day because we've got some big news and I like it because regular updates keep coming around SafeMoon and this is what you want from, you know, something you're invested in. You want updates. You want to know what's going on before people come out calling a scam or anything like that. At least again, updates. Every updates and, you know, look at these cool animations. It just makes me happy. But yeah, you know, this is the next big thing and as I speak, you know, tokens are getting burnt and as tokens get burnt, this crypto has more room to run. You guys should know that. So if you guys are new around here, hit that subscribe button, turn on the notification bell as well so you guys don't miss out on any updates on SafeMoon and we'll get started. So once again, you know, my name's ODR, Own Damn Research is the key to success. You have to know what you buy and hold. And I also want to say, guys, you know, none of this financial advice. I'm just giving you guys my own take on it because I am heavily invested in SafeMoon and this one nft art finance i make updates on now i'm planning on doing videos on elon gate if you guys want videos on that let me know down in the comments because this one looks like a very solid token for me that i feel as if it's very good to make a video on because okay we'll get into that later but yeah safe moon safe moon safe moon now please avoid anything else that has the word moon in it just f focus on safe moon because it's the only reliable one and everything else is coming up because of safe moon they think they can copy safe moon and follow the same patterns when it's impossible safe moon has a six billion dollar market cap no other cryptocurrency achieved that in the launch safe moon also has more than 1.4 million holders as i speak it shows 1.3 obviously on the website but it's more than 1.4 because it hasn't been updated for a couple hours now and on top of that guys you guys need to know the fundraiser page is officially completed which means they now have hundreds million i mean one million dollars to now complete the fundraiser app which means safe moon exchange is coming their own exchange is coming so we'll get into that and the charts later but i just want to quickly say you know the first big news is safe moon is landing in the middle east we talked about that in my last video and the video before that because this was announced obviously early yesterday i mean two days ago by the time you're watching this video safe moon is landing in the middle east coming soon you know safe moon is coming to you know the warranty exchange which people from middle east use so we welcome them new exchange coming that's what it was if a coin has a large number of users we will list it binance if you know they have one 1.4 million holders like i said but the only issue around this is safe moon need to relax all right it's part of the listing process you can't keep spamming them so you know the company can't spam binance non-stop they're gonna get annoyed at it so i really hope safeman can calm down on that as well it's gonna get me annoyed as well but then again i'm still bullish but please just calm down on spamming binance but yeah fundraiser completed we'll look into that now so remember as i keep saying binance you guys keep laughing but just know that binance listing is towards the end of the year and Binance themselves said if a token is getting a lot of volume in and a lot of people are talking about it, they will list it. They don't have any, you know, picks they go through. They list anything that has a lot of volume and a lot of people talking about it. SafeMoon could happen and it's literally in SafeMoon's roadmap for Q3 and I like it. So let's celebrate as more tokens get burnt. I believe it was 400 trillion that got burnt so far. 411 trillion tokens burnt so far. I remember, like I said, more than 40% tokens have been burnt. The more that gets burnt, it gives it more room for safe moon to run. And the reason why I feel as if we're holding a price is because I feel as if paper hands are leaving, which is a very good thing. And the people that were here for the short term are gone. And people are realizing that safe moon is actually a, not a scam. It's not a pump and dump. And it actually has a function to keep growing. And that's why people are leaving. Some people are, were in it for just little gains. But we're in it for the long run because we believe in safe moon and there's been a lot of people coming at us already and we dealt with them and we're still here holding strong. If safe moon was a scam, this wouldn't have a billion market cap at this early stage. So we're still in the early stages and we're, we've grown so much and I like it. We're still trending number one in the last eight days in a row. Last eight days in a row. So um, yeah, you guys can see the funding you know, page has been completed. I can't wait for this to launch the safe moon exchange my plan is if you can you know i believe you will be able to stake on this as well but if you can stake i'm 100 moving my safe moon um tokens trust wallet all the way to safe moon exchange so look at this it looks so nice this you know the layout and you could even customize it as well look at here you got the black white um i think this dark gray there as well and the greenish one you'll see um yeah i like all of them like imagine you can do black and green together that looks so nice 
I like the fact that you know it's more like user friendly. You can design it the way you want, and there's not many exchanges that have it out there. But I really like these type of exchanges. I mean, I like these stuff where it's more customizable, and I like customizing a lot of things. Like even my 12 Pro Max, my iPhone. I don't just care about a phone. I want to design it like everything customized. I get these random accessories to just make it look nice, and I want it to be nice and clean. Like you see with iOS 12, how you can you know customize your layouts and stuff like that. Like you get what I mean? Like you, I like customizing stuff. So that's my own personal opinion on that bit. But yeah, look at these cryptocurrencies we're expected to be launching on the exchange: Polkadot, Ethereum, BNB, XRP, you know, Cardano, uh, USDT, Chainlink, Litecoin, XLM, Doge. And yeah, I have to also make a video around Dogecoin because there's something I want to make a video on on Dogecoin. Now, you guys know I'm not a fan of Dogecoin, but there's something big that's going to be happening from now to uh, May 8th. Now that I said the date, you guys are probably going to find out already. So I don't even need to make a video, but I really want to make a video on it because it's going to be something big. So let's look at the live chart before we move on to the Barnsley Exchange and see how that is for the Middle East because we're going to be listed there. Welcome along, you legends. But yeah barcoding is the best thing ever in my opinion you know it's slowly it's going to get ready for spike and we're all going to be in it look at all these buying orders that's coming in recently slowly there's more buying orders than selling orders obviously like i said all the paper hands are going that were expecting short-term gains and i'm very happy about that like i'm always in it for the long run and i know safemen is one that's not finished yet there's a lot of room that is still there to be running and it's just a matter of when it's just a matter of when this decides to explode again but i know this is soon going to explode again and you know we're in it way too early like look at these prices it went all the way up it wasn't even meant to be at these prices but it still went up there for a, you know small cryptocurrency a new cryptocurrency that came out from the beginning to all the way there having a six billion market cap insane insane it smashed it and i'm very happy with safe moon but let's move on to the barrency exchange see more about that i want to learn more about that as well and see how it is i just love seeing the exchanges we get listed on so this is the middle east exchange barrency global that safe moon is going to be officially listed on and we're already listed on other exchanges as well like zbg exchange for china and every other exchange there's more than seven exchanges way more than seven exchanges we are now listed on altogether and we're still a new cryptocurrency we're growing so much we also get rewarded for holding and i just can't wait for all these tokens to be burnt and i believe these tokens will keep getting burnt at a fast pace so the waiting is over is this the safe moon news start a trade buy token and currency exchange oh this is a new exchange for them so that's very good but at least they have their hands on buying cryptos. Let's see what type of cryptos they have so we can learn more about them. So they have ADAR, they have ALGO, they have ATOM, they have USDT, they have... Um, wait, they got... I mean, when I said ALGO, that was um, thingy, I meant USDT. So they got Bitcoin. They got... Oh, wait, that one's weird, by the way. Why did they have it like that? But yeah, they got ADAR, Bitcoin um i don't know why they do it like that they got out bitcoin ethereum what's this they yeah this is confusing as hell uh they got dogecoin i'm guessing dash link they got chain link there luna i don't know if they you know word it different but it looks oh it, you can stake stuff as well that's very good buy crypto let's just go buy crypto because that was confusing as hell oh it's because we were on spot but let's see what happens here. That just looked weird. Okay, so this looks like a Binance layout. This looks exactly like a Binance layout, which means it's easy to, you know, navigate and buy stuff. You could even use it if you're from UK. Wow. So uh, you could buy stuff with Great British Pounds. You could buy stuff with Euros, USDT, I believe. Yeah, USDT. So I guess we can have our hands on this as well if we wanted. So they have Bitcoin, Ethereum, Chainlink, Litecoin, USDT. That's what they have. Okay. Um... Does it change when I change the currency? Because I know some exchanges do that. When you change the currency, there's more available. Okay, no, they got some big ones and they're adding SafeMoon in on here. So why are they showing some different things over here unless I'm looking at something else? But the staking rewards as well, at least they got staking rewards. So they're definitely going to gift you guys rewards for holding this. They got high APY rewards, but I don't know what they're for. It's all sold out as well. But... It looks good. It looks alright. Um, obviously, I'm kind of confused on the way it is. This is my first time going on it. Um, yeah, this is my first time going on it. They seem to have Ethereum here as well. So, they do actually have a lot of exchanges. 
but it's just confusing because this is my first time going on it and getting familiar with it but then again you know welcome along middle east hopefully you guys like this exchange that we're listed on and i hope we can keep expanding on your countries you know china and i don't know about what's happening with india's exchange but yeah at least we got a confirmed exchange for middle east and china zbg exchange and the barency exchange and you know we're already on zbg now we're confirmed going to barency we're not on there yet but we are next stop is going to be finding india's exchange i believe unless we found it let me know down in the comments see you guys in my next video hit that subscribe button turn the notification bell another big day for safe as big news keeps dropping i'm gonna try to do one safe moon video a day you guys are telling me you guys love the big day safe safe moon uh, title videos so why not every night uk time probably 4 a.m 5 a.m 4 a.m i'll say every night uk time 4 a.m boom safe moon video and then i'll change my schedule for every other video because i need to do nft art finance as well in there and stuff like that see you guys in my next video hit that subscribe button turn on the notification bell as always and take care Bye bye